Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new PowerPoint game. Let's get straight into it. So this is a Easter game. I'm going to call it the Easter Bunny Bomb game. And just to let you know that there are two different fonts that are needed for this game. One of them has been embedded into the PPT when I've saved it. However, unfortunately, the other one will not embed uh, naturally. So what you have to do is just uh, download the font from the Google Drive link that I will put in the description and install the font by yourself. Very easy to do and only takes a, a matter of seconds. Uh, in most cases, you do tend to have to restart the computer to make the font work in the PPT. Okay, so that's that. And this game is a little bit different in that I've designed it to work uh, with a points counter or without using the points counter. The reason I've done this is that a lot of students actually enjoy um, taking care of the points in my classes. So we've got the option in this game for a points counter or no points counter. And I've explained all of that in this slide here. Basically, the, um, the little rabbit who's in the blue egg, he will be in the top right hand corner of every point slide. And he will take you back to the main question slide. And the, <laughs> the rabbit with the big egg, big colorful egg, he'll take you back to the points counter and also the backgrounds of the other slide, they will take you back to the points counter. Anyway, I'll show you more of that in just a moment. Um, I've also put in the song. Uh, this song, most of the um, slides that I've made are using the music from this song. It's called the Easter Bunny Rap, so you can go ahead and show that if you like. However, I'm going to get straight now to the game. Easter English game or the Easter Bunny Bomb game. You can call it how you like. And um, here's the point system. So I'm just going to go ahead and skip this as we're going to see how the points work as we go through the game. Nice bit of intro here. Are you ready? Let's play. And this cute rabbit, he's going to come out of the shell there. It's very cute. And here we are, the main question slide. <laughs> With some music going on there. So I'm going to choose question number one. I just click on the uh, rabbit in the shell there. As always, it's a template, so please put in your own question. You can insert a uh, picture in the middle here and then use the space bar or click on the mouse to reveal the uh, answer. And click again. So question number one here. I think we have five points here. Yep, five points. And you can see here, there has, we have this rabbit in the bottom right hand corner. So if I click on him, him or her maybe, uh, that's going to take me to the points counter. So for team one, I can put in five points. If you want to change the text here, team one, you can make a, a team name, uh, you know, whatever, rabbit team, egg team, Easter team, happy team. And once you've done the points, simply click on this rabbit character with the egg. That would take you back to the main question slide. So now I'm going to choose another question. I'm going to go for number seven, lucky seven. So it's a template as always, question and uh, answer and click again <laughs> this time we have the bomb bunny bomb There's two big booms on the on this one and then simply go to the bottom right hand corner click on the uh, rabbit there and that will take you back to this uh, points counter here again so we don't have any points this time because we have the bomb so we just leave it as zero click on the rabbit with the egg and we go back to the points counter uh, next one i'm going to choose is number eight Easter question and Easter answer and click on the space bar or click on the mouse. This time we've got the choice choice uh, slide. So there's no numbers here, just colors. So they can choose red or blue, orange or green. Now in order to make, uh, to reveal the points that are behind, just click on the color. Don't click on the egg, click on the color within the rectangular box. So for example, here we've got change points on the blue, <laughs> we've got the bomb again on the green we've got the one egg with a slower sound file there slower actions and here on the orange we've got uh, five five points so to go to the points counter we simply click on the background that will take us to the points counter and team three whatever points they get they can take and click on the bunny with the egg and that will take you back to the main question slide. Uh, let's choose question number nine. Same again, question and answer. 
And this time we've got the change points. Very nice, uh, simple slide there. Actually, it's quite a simple game. There's nothing too fancy in this game, to be honest. Uh, this one, click on the background. That would take you to the points counter, and you can put in whatever points you want in there. 50 points, 100 points, 1 point. Click on the rabbit with the egg to take you back to the main question slide. So the last one I'm going to choose is question number 12. Put in your question and your answer and put in a picture in the middle and click on the space bar. So this one, a little bit more interesting. Are you ready for some extra points? Got this cute bunny here and then lots and lots and lots of eggs are going to suddenly uh, pop out. How many have we got here? Yeah, nine. So this one is nine points. Now to go to the points counter, you can click on the text of nine points or you can click on any of these eggs. Please don't click on the background, just click on the text or the eggs. So click in the top left hand corner on nine points. That will take me to the points counter again. Uh, actually we had 10 points there, so put that in. Like that, click on the rabbit with the big colorful egg that takes you back to the main question slide. So that is it. So the last thing I would just say, I'm just going to randomly choose anything. I choose just say number 10, question and answer. Okay, so here I think we've got three points. Okay. Now, what we did before, we clicked on this rabbit with the big colorful egg. If you don't want to use the points counter, you can go ahead and click on this rabbit who's at the top. So in the top right hand corner, it's very small, there's a small rabbit in the, the blue egg shell there. Just click on this one, that will take you back to the main points counter without, sorry, the main <laughs> question slide without using the points counter. Get my words right. Let's just choose another one, like 15. This will be the same again, okay? So this is the extra points one. And as you can see, the rabbit is in the top right hand corner blue one I'm gonna cut this one short click on that takes you back to the main question slide let's just do one more for fun 22 okay so same again here three points wait for that rabbit to appear in the top right hand corner and click on him so this game can work in two ways you can either use it with the points counter or without the points counter of course this is a seasonal game I do believe Easter is next week I don't really keep a track on Easter not living in a country that really celebrates it anymore and um, I haven't made this a really big fancy game it's relatively simple although it does look kind of pretty good to be honest um, so it's quite a simple game I think it's around a hundred megabytes not too large size so yeah nice and simple something that can be used this week and next week yeah, maybe some other times if you want to if kids like it anyway I hope that you <laughs> <laughs> can make good use of this game I hope you can enjoy this game I have a feeling that I've managed to do this in one take today um, you have no idea how many takes I do of these videos I always stumble on some words I did it once in this video but I, I kind of got away with it anyway have a very happy 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 Easter and um, much thanks for enjoying these games, for watching these videos, and so much thanks for people subscribing. As of today, 406 subscribers. And um, I am making another channel where there's going to be, all of these games are going to be on the other channel. They're already there, actually. And also there's going to be other kind of technology-based stuff on there. Anyway, that's it. Take care, have a great evening, morning, afternoon, weekend, weekday, whatever you are, in whatever time dimension you're living. Take care, Jalga. bye, bye.